And I'm Julio. And this is Channel 10 CPSX News. Our, we have a warrior with the latest and greatest breaking news. Our first story is a mill fire. This mill fire occurred at the Ikela Joska Mill. There were 250 fatalities, a new record. Raquel, do you remember the old record? I believe it was 194 fatalities prior to this one. That's quite a lot of fatalities. Do you happen to know why so many people die? Well, nowadays the owners really don't care that much about their workers, so when a fire happens, it happens. Yes, there are many safety things that need to be uh, addressed, and there are many concerns for workers' rights, but there aren't many unions in place, and for now, I don't see anything happening in the future except for more fires and more deaths. It's very true, Julio. Now let's go over to our man on the street, Zane Yu. Thanks, Julian Raquel. Today I'm here with Rock, a coal miner. How long have you been working today? Um, I finally just came home after my 18-hour shift. Uh, brought home a nice Christmas tree from the company store. Best one there by far. Cost me like two cents, a lot of money, but gotta do what you gotta do, be in the Christmas spirit, you know? That is a very nice Christmas tree. Thank you. Um, what do you think about your employer? Uh, he's not a very nice man, I mean bosses us around all the time. Rich does whatever he wants. Really not fair. Sounds unpleasant. Have you heard of the socialist reforms? I have heard of them. Um, I wish I could be part of them, but it's kind of hard these days. Gotta make some money. Can't lose my job, but I think it's an awesome thing. Yeah. Thank you for your opinion. And now I'm with Lucia, a mill worker. How long have you been working today? Um, what time is it? Oh, right. I'm about 12 hours in my 16-hour work day. That is a long time. What do you think about your employer? He's nice enough, I guess. Is this being recorded? No. He's actually really mean. All he cares about is his own money. Hmm. Have you heard of the socialist performance? Yeah, they're the best things I've heard in the, la in the past few years. They think about it. Instead of the miserable conditions that my friends and I are living in, we could all be equal to our employers. That is true. Thank you, Lucia, for your opinion. Thank you, Zane, for giving us a perspective on the mill workers. And now we will talk to Brooke, our woman on the street, about the factory owners and their perspectives on the issues at hand. Thanks, Raquel and Julio, and today I'm here with Vlox. How are you doing today? Well, are you happy with your place in society? That's wonderful. What do you spend your money on? That's very nice. Do you agree with the ideas of capitalism? Thank you very much for your time. And today I'm here with Daddy Warbucks. And how do you feel about the government? I love the government. I own the government. I am the government. Do you ever think of the poor? Poor what? Okay. What poor? No. Where oh, do they you... bring me my champagne. Yes, no, I think of it. Yes. Where do you get your money from? Daddy. From the factory. And the other factory. And all the other factories that I own. That's very interesting. Have you ever heard of the socialist reforms? Yes, I believe I have. I think they're stupid. Well, thank you, Mr. Warbucks, and back over to Raquel and Julia. Thanks, Brooke, for your insight. Now, here's our daily update on the women's strike. Today is day 49 of the strike. Um, there are still clothes not being made, and you can see on various uh, stores that the prices of the clothes are slowly getting higher and higher because they're less people to make the clothes. Um, it seems to us that the strike has been going on, it'll keep going on for another 47 days. Um, and there's really no end in sight. It's quite an issue. Thank you, Julio, for this information. And now we're going to go to Caroline with the daily weather. Hi. The weather for you all today will be very sunny, only a few clouds in the sky, around 70 degrees, very low humidity, and overall a great day. On the other hand, for the poor people, the weather is going to be cold, rainy, chance of a hurricane, and even a worse chance of your life getting even worse. Thank you, Caroline, for the weather. And now, here's our viral video of the week. You get the limo out front.
abused workers that no one ever discovers. Everyone knows what money like me. You can go pretty far. You get the best of our world. Their lives may be low while we're rolling it dough. You get the best of my world. Shift us with together and you know that. Well, that was very interesting. I agree, and now a word from our sponsors. Hi, my name is Zane, and this is my wife Caroline. And we met on Capitalist Mingle. And we've been happy ever since. And when I first saw her, she was carrying bags of money, and that just struck me so hard. I made a Capitalist Mingle so I can meet others like myself. And we found each other over Capitalist Mingle. Capitalist Mingle is the best dating website ever. It pairs me with the top 1% of the population. And you know, being a lesbian is illegal, but it's okay because we have money. Thanks, Capitalist Mingle. Hi, I'm Stephanie Wallace, but I go by Crystal, and I'm here with Zane. Zane, so uh, we met on Capitalist Mingle, and we've had a wonderful relationship ever since. I love Crystal because she gave me pets. I gave him these two pets. We have a very loving and wealthy relationship together. And it's going to continue forever. Right, Zane? Sure. Welcome to the Capitalist Grill. The food is subpar, but it's wonderful to talk to other people who understand insubordinate workers. I recently had a worker who tried to get out of my coal mine and steal my pickaxe. But I smacked him and cut off his arm. Because I can't stand them. Nice, high five. They, they need to go back in their place. Ooh, nickel. I can't even stand them. I'm in charge of them, and you know, they work in my mind. Do you have any other experiences similar? Yes. I completely understand where you're coming from. They're just ridiculous these days. Did you know about the mill that, like, the fire? All the workers are just happy. It was, like, the best thing ever. I know. I like roasted marshmallows. <laughs> You guys know how I feel, right? <laughs> yes. Yeah, yeah, yes. It was it was worth it. I slept well for like five days straight after that. I, you know, I, I, I got a little recording of their screaming and it was just wonderful. You know? They made it into a movie too. Oh awesome. Oh, I can't wait to see it. Yeah. Oh, that's it comes awesome. out tomorrow. Oh. <laughs> Let's go. Five of us. It's a party. Awesome. Hey. Well, I actually had a date at the Capitalist Grill tonight with a very wealthy man in a top hat. Oh, well, lucky him. Uh, that's the end of our newscast today, and please stay tuned for another exciting episode of How I Met Your Banker.